until this season, Arkansas didn't own a sellout in Little Rock since 1994. Now they've got back-to-back -back sellouts as tonight they try to go 2-0 in the SEC, matching up with the Kentucky Wildcats. 100 yarder against the Florida Gators last week as Laderette kicks it away. They're going to try to keep it away from him. Fair catch is called for by the up man in passing, averaging 436 yards a game underneath Anthony White. Can't get out. He's dropped for no game. Kept up. They can't afford to. In a little rock. Couch on third and better than 10 over the middle of the tight end. He's got a first down. That's James Whalen, a young man from Portland. Battling his way, losing the football, and Arkansas buys a break at the 41. What a break it is coming up with an Orlando. We're the game. We'll get to a little bit later. Wide again. Slow down to the backfield. Second and a dozen. Running east in motion. The reverse for Yeast. A clear out. They seal the side. Craig Yeast with big yardage. Breaks the tackle for a first down. Up to the 45-yard line. A spades on the outside. Into the corner for McCord to check that yeast. Touchdown, Kentucky. For the first time in the game, Joel, they line up in a pretty much. Madre Hill, big crease. He hits it to the 30. Down the side for a first down outside of the 42. Save with a strong safety. Brings up third and five for the 41 of the Wildcats. Takuma on the option pass. Back to the quarterback, Sterner. Will he get it? Yes. Wow. Inside the 20, the gadget play to the 17. Elementary school students to play high school football. Takuma bouncing wide. Will he get to the end zone? Yes, touchdown, Arkansas. Joel, one of the things that Arkansas does so well, and we commented to it last week, the wide receivers do a great job of blocking down Fiedel Smith. Take a look to the right of your screen. At the point of attack, the blocks are there. Now when he breaks through, he should be contending with some secondary people, but he is a nice block by Burlsworth. Look at Smith downfield, just stuffing the corner. And this he backs to the shotgun formation. After the play fake. And Derek Homer in the neighborhood, but all over the quarterback once again. Pocket again holding up well. Couch finding the tight end. He's got the first down at Jimmy Haley. Tied at seven. Blitz is coming. Floating not in the flat. Big play for Kevin Coleman. Blocking downfield by Yee. Just barely oh, second and goal. Looking for more outside the three. Mickles it in motion. And Couch in trouble. The blitz by Kennedy. McCord the motion man. They pick up the blitz, going for McCord. Touchdown, Kentucky. Green, the quarterback, 14 to 7. Now it's wide open. It's Coleman. What a shot he took from Zach Painter. Let me tell you something, though. When he bounces up. Fourth and four, 848 left in the half. They show the blitz. Here it comes. They pick it up for Couch. And his man falls down. Got tangled up. So Wide receiver Williams in motion. Give to Madre Hill a bolt up the middle. First guy that normally doesn't stop. Second and call it nine. Will Sterner be on target finally? Yes. Great grab by Michael Williams. We'll make it Anthony Lucas rather. For Arkansas. Pocket holds up. Sterner with time. The safety's there for the interception. Picking it off. David Johnson. And out across the midfield strike. He read it perfectly from Sterner. Georgia military. Wildcat fans aren't complaining. Anthony White buried in the backfield. Over to the opposite side against Orlando Green. Quentin McCord. Gouch out of the shotgun. Pressure again. It'll fall incomplete. Painter on the corner blitz. I've got to give credit. Also, his own offensive coordinator. On the play fake, Sterner has to hurry. Wide open, Anthony Lucas. All the way down to the 10. Frustrating for the Bogs. 21 yard field goal attempt for Todd Laderette. Out of the hole to Grant Pruitt. He's dropping on its way and blocked by Kentucky. Right up the middle. And we saw it last week, low line. Count going deep for McCord. 
And the ball taken in by McCord. He battled Green and got it. Right through the hands the tight end. Second and goal from the two. Couch has Mickelson. Touchdown, Kentucky. The motion man wide open. And Craig East, the out. Kentucky, a 14-point lead. He pushed it. Not so automatic, was it? From the 43 of the Wildcats. Turner on the play fake. Long route. Lucas available inside the 10. And they say he stepped out of bounds at the 5 with the flag down. Five with only 27 yards. Plenty of distance, and he's got it. 10-point ball game with 7-16 left in the third quarter. The shotgun. Three wide receivers set. Pocket collapsing, Captain traveling down. Well, you asked about three and out. They get a big play immediately from CJ. Razorbacks tonight. Matre Hill, play fake instead. And he catches him in stride. The wide receiver. Almost 28 yards on the reception. This time in the eye. Matre Hill, big catch. And Matre Hill with another first down. All the way to the 13. Right down the middle between the hash marks, and he splits the uprights. So they stall on a first and goal on the last series, either or a favorite route. They're all his favorites. On third and over 10, hits him in stride. White's got the first down in Arkansas. Out of the shotgun on first down from the 32. Strong throw, intercepted. Picked up by Barrett. Will he go the distance? No, pulled down from behind inside the 15 to the 13. Joel, that's a great a time left of the play clock. On the slant, inside the five, and he make it. Diving, lunging, touchdown, Arkansas, and Anthony Lucas. himself up takes the collision take a look at the throw he's leaning forward takes the whack determined to get in the end zone folks got a tie ball game looking in that direction and firing on the slam hanging on and just barely for the first time tonight michael snowden who had three kicks like tonight moving sterner looking for the tight end first down what a grab as it's right in the middle of the field. They spread the defense with three wide receivers to play fake instead. Strainer with time, has a man wide open. Touchdown, Arkansas. Hubert Lauderdale. My only catch of the game had been a touchdown. I'd be pretty thrilled, too. 20 unanswered points now for the Razorbacks. Sterner has come alive. Well, he's on the season. Couch, beating his face. Finds his man, but he can't hang on. Jimmy Robertson, Zach Painter with a stick. And Zach Painter has come up big for 41. Now, second and 10. Couch in trouble and taken down. Another sack for the Razorbacks. Third, a little less than seven. Pocket holds up wide open. It's Gary Davis. First and ten inside the 15 at the 13. And he is definitely down and out on that play. Now, there's a situation, though, that this is play way too soft to zone. Couch right down the middle is able to get the ball. There's the big whack. But, of course, right now they're checking him out. Now, what they can do is that Couch needs to get his people right up to the line of scrimmage right there because the clock is going to start, and he can spike the ball right away. Or, right now, he can hustle over and get a couple of plays, two plays right now with the clock. Be interesting to see what he decides. To do. He throws it into a sea of red, and now this is it for him, Joel. To the inside. Final play of regulation. Over the middle. Over shoots his man, and it was available in the end zone for Kevin Coleman as Arkansas wins. He had exactly what he wanted, Joel. He's able to look the free safety off just a little bit too long. Boy, oh boy, did Couch put on a show, but give Arkansas credit, Joel. 20 unanswered points when it looked like that they were given up for dead. 
Houston Nutt is the happiest man in the world. All night long in Little Rock. So long, everybody.